Hi, I'm David. I'm the finance manager here at Mercer UK. And my job is to monitor our income and how we've used it, to manage our current funds so that we can meet all our commitments and to help plan for the future. We've been looking at the events of Easter we can come to Easter Saturday now, when I think those who knew Jesus who were maybe confused and disappointed at the situation they found themselves in after recent events. They didn't seem to match the promises that they were looking forward to. In my job, I know that God has promised to supply all our needs, but I sometimes find myself in a position where those promises don't seem to be matched by the numbers on the current cash flow. At times like this, I find it's good just to go back to the promises and think about them and think about who made the promises and to think about the times when God has provided for us in a way that we weren't even expecting. If you're dealing with the tension of being living in the gap uh, where your current experience doesn't match the promises that you've received, I want you to know that God is not just in the promise or its fulfillment, but is with you in every step of the process. If you're living in the gap where hope and experience don't match, I want to encourage you to wait on him because I know that he has promised and he's faithful and he will keep his promises.